Let's talk about installing WordPress. There are two different ways to install WordPress. You can start with any of these. It completely depends on you. These both are pretty easy to use and I will walk you through all the process from beginning to end and step by step in the next couple of lectures. It depends on whether do you want just to learn WordPress or you want to build the project for yourself or for your client. One way is to install the WordPress at your own computer which means you set up a private WordPress site on your own computer without any cost. It would not be a live site but great for learning and experimenting privately. We don't need to buy the domain name and hosting for that. It's all free. Another way is to purchase the domain name and the hosting for that and it will be a web host where you set up a live public site on a web server you need to get the domain name and the hosting to use the wordpress for a web hosting installation there are many companies and the sites which are giving the domain and hosting in a reasonable budget it is best for those who want to build a real site as app so it means if you want to install the WordPress locally, you can use it for your learning process and you can also build the site here and then move the site to the domain name if you purchase it later. But if you want to install the WordPress on the web server, it is also super easy and you need to buy the domain name and the hosting for that and it is also great for learning and experimenting. So we will discuss more in the next lecture. Thank you so much. Please make sure to subscribe this channel so you will get the latest updates. Thanks.